Twas the night before the election when all through the towns, voters in their ridings were deciding which politician will be Ottawa bound. I'm going to try and vote for the person I think is best for where I live. Elections Canada warns your voting location may have changed from the previous election. Some of those sites were either not available or were not meeting the safety. Uh, for uh, COVID-19, so the physical distancing. There are about 1,000 fewer polling stations across the country because of this. You might be voting at unusual places. For example, this funeral home on Main Street East and this one on King Street East in Hamilton are now polling stations, and so is the Ontario Science Centre in Toronto. COVID safety measures will be in place, so people say they aren't too worried about voting in person. If everyone's wearing their masks and they're following safety protocols, then I'm not worried. If they're following protocols, then I wouldn't be worried about that. It'll be in and out. I've worked elections before. It's it's safe. They always have it sorted. It'll be it'll be good. You should have received your voter information card in the mail. If you've lost it, you can go to elections.ca, type in your postal code, and it will tell you where you can go vote. I don't know why I didn't get a voting card, but I just Googled it and I was like, all right, this is how we're going to figure it out because everything is one click away so you can easily figure everything out. Everything was perfect in the mail when I got it. Told me exactly where, when. Even Snapchat, the app mostly used by the younger generation, sent out instructions on how to cast your ballot. 5,780,000 Canadians voted in advance polls. Which is an increase of about you know 18% from um, other uh, previous the previous election. But there's four days of event polls, so I think it's very convenient for electors. More than one million voted by mail or at an Elections Canada office with a special ballot, which is an increase of about 600,000 compared to last election. You know, certainly COVID has something to do with um, the vote by mail request. Elections Canada has said those ballots are expected to be counted on Tuesday, but they are reminding voters heading to the polls tomorrow to treat those working at them with respect. They're your neighbors. Um, there are people of the community who decide to come and work, you know, for a day. And so I encourage everybody to be patient and um, nice at the poll because they're there to help you to vote. I just uh, hope it's not a big line. Well, if it's a big lineup, I guess that's a good thing, right? Canada speaking. You'll need to prove who you are and where you live when you come cast your vote at one of these polling stations tomorrow. So bring a piece of ID like a driver's license. And if you don't drive, bring something that will show proof of address like a utility bill.